my darlings, it's Dion Dean. Welcome back to another video. I actually hadn't planned to do this video, but I'm like, the stuff is here, so why not? I have a Rent the Runway. Oh, there you go. You can see right there. Rent the Runway um, try on for you guys. I'm going to a cocktail party, and <laughs> the dress that I was going to wear, my girlfriend was just like, no, that's not cocktail attire. So on Monday, I went, no, Sunday, I was like, you know what? I'm not shopping for a cocktail dress because it's just gonna sit there like it's not something that you can wear 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 again so i was like you know what let me get something from rent the runway so here are four dresses i don't know if they're going to fit i don't know how they're going to fit these are brands that i've one of the dresses i've actually um rented prior you've seen that one before the christian suriano dress and i got it as a backup because i know that that works but the other dresses i have no idea how they're going to look um on my body so i'm gonna show you the dress that i the initial dress that I thought was so amazing. And she was like, no. These Miami girls are so critical. She was like, no, you're not wearing that. All right, so let me try on that dress and then I'm gonna show you this, these four dresses. Okay, so before I have on the dress right now, but before I show you the dress, I actually wanna show you the, um, <laughs> the shoes because I got the shoes for the dress. I was so excited. I I thought I was gonna wear this dress, and so I got these Balenciaga. If you follow me on Instagram, I am Dion Dean, and you saw these. I did um, an unboxing, actually, in this dress, but of these Balenciaga knife um, knife point shoes or knife knife. I think they're just called knife. Um, I don't remember how much I got them for, but on the bottom here. You can see the regular price was $7.95 and then they were $4.95 wherever these were sold. I don't know why I feel like this is a Century 21 label. I'm not quite sure. Anyway, I got these shoes to go with the yellow in this dress and I thought I was really doing something. So let me just show you the dress. Maybe you'll like it. <laughs> okay, married women, how did we put on clothes? before we got married. Because I'm like, <laughs> I need my husband to zip this up the way he did the other day. Anyway, so this is a dress. This is a dress I actually got off of um, ASOS. No, I got it off of Poshmark. It's an ASOS dress. And I thought that I was really doing something. Hold on. I thought I was really, I thought I was really <laughs> cute with these shoes. And she was like, no, so. This started the whole conversation. I really loved this. I thought it was very cocktail, but apparently I'm not cocktail enough. So yeah, ASOS, Poshmark. I really, this is coming out at some point during the summer. I don't know. No, I do know actually, it's coming out at some point during the summer, but I just guess not to this cocktail party. So let's get to the try on. Let me preface this by saying, South Florida girls are different than other women, okay? Our dresses are too tight, <laughs> too short, too glittery, too over the top. If you've ever been on vacation in South Florida, how you vacation is how we dress all the time. So you know when you're like buying clothes and stuff, love it. That's how we dress 365. I'm gonna say that before I show you this dress. I don't think this dress does anything for me. It is, you see where my knees are? <laughs> it is short, even for me, because you know your girl does short, and I do, my clothes are way too tight and way too short, and I love it, so comment if you like, but I don't care. They're always gonna be too tight and too short. But this, <laughs> my hoo-ha is like <laughs> right there. I get, I get, I get it. I don't even want to turn around and show you. I get it. I get it. My friend would probably love this. But it's not for me because I'm not going to be comfortable. Like there's, I can't. I am feeling some kind of way in it though. Oh, so let me say that this is a 22. Um, most, I think the largest they go up to is 22. There are some 24s, but I didn't see anything 24. 
um, as far as cocktail. The only reason why I would go up is because it is cocktail and cocktail is unforgiving, that I know. But I think for a size 22, this is great. If this was like, just a little bit, not even a little bit, it needs to give me like at least three inches longer. Yeah. <laughs> This is Miami girl though. Let me tell you something. There's some women right now that have this in their suitcase. They're gonna be wearing this out tonight and I would not blame them. Okay, let's go to the next one. <laughs> okay, my darlings. I had to take the wig off to put on the dress. That's how serious it is. So this is a size 22 bag. We Mishka, we all know with designer brands, you need to go up. My breasts are squashed. This is just exposed. It's way too short, but it goes with these shoes perfectly. So I was really, really hoping that this would work. What I'm gonna do for vanity's sake is try and shift these breasts. <laughs> Women, why do we do this to ourselves to try and fit to something that we know does not fit? But I feel like I can make it work. I'm gonna do some shiftation. <laughs> get in the mirror with these shoes just for vanity's sake just for vanity's sake let's do it okay i've done all the shiftation that i'm going to do and you know what if i suck in all night i think it may actually work <laughs> i just can't breathe i can't drink i can't do anything I just gotta stand there like, oh look, I gotta stand there like this all night long. Whew. I actually really like this with these shoes. Whew. Oh God. Miami standards, this fits. If you're from here, you know what I'm talking about. Our clothes are so ill-fitting. <laughs> we wear the tightest, most inappropriate dresses. So this is slaying in South Florida standards. So trust and believe it's still a contender. I know all of you out there are probably like, damn girl, don't do it. I'm just letting you know I'm in South Florida, okay. Whew. All right, let's cover the girdle. <laughs> so this is Jonathan Simke. This fits a lot better, feels a lot better. This is more of an, I'm sorry, I rolled it up, but that's how it looks just plain. But merchandising it up, this is how I would wear it. It feels really good, I feel comfortable. I'll probably have to wear a body shaper that's cut like biker shorts. Can you guys see how this wrap always is good for me because it draws in this part of your body. You're not seeing the little, belly fat here but the girls are sitting up high i'll probably put on my good good savage fenty bra but um yeah i feel sexy i feel good i feel comfortable now that being said <laughs> i don't always go for the comfortable choice this is just the way dion dean is made this is why my husband no longer well i don't really ask my husband how i look no i don't really ask him how i look but he never says, babe, that's nice or not, because he knows I'm not really, I, I will put on a dress and be like, yes, this is it. And then five minutes before we're supposed to walk out the door, change, so he doesn't offer his opinion and I don't really ask him anyway. Um, so I say that to say this is looking like number one for right now. That's what I'll say, because I like, I like this as well, but it's it's really nice and it fits well and it feels comfortable. Yeah, I like the shoulders. You guys see that? I like the shoulders. It just looks really good. And this actually has a clasp. I look I don't know why people do like wrap things and don't put a clasp here again. I just don't think they're thinking about women with busts. I just don't think they do. Anyway. Here's that. Let's go to the last dress. Okay, so this dress, I already knew I loved it. I've rented it before. Sorry, I didn't like put myself in it. This is Christian Suriano. So you can see how short it is. It's giving me a liar vibes. 
and that's why I love it. It's very structured, like the, it goes, it's just a good dress. And I know exactly how I wanna wear it. And I know exactly the wig I'm gonna put on. I want like a very short, structured bob. Like it needs to be very to go with the squares. It's just, I just like, I just like this dress. My friend is going to be probably gonna say it's not cocktail enough. And I see that because this is something that I would probably wear on a regular day, to be honest. Let's get in the mirror because I want you to see how I envision it. Let's get in the mirror. Okay, so here's the dress. And here's how I want to wear it with these cute little red shoes from Zara that I got yesterday. I knew they were coming and I was like, oh my God, that'd be so cute. I just love, I love that. I don't know if it's cocktail enough though. Sorry, like I'm thinking as I'm talking to you, but it's so Alaya. It's so Alaya esque. I think she's gonna hate this. If she didn't like the yellow one, she's definitely gonna not like this one. I think in my brain, she's gonna go for the stripy Bagley and Mishka one, the Tom Ford esque one. Sorry, the striped sequin one that's very tom ford i think that's the one she's gonna say that she likes and she's gonna tell me to squeeze my <laughs> a double s into it and let's go i actually as i'm filming this video have been taking pictures to send to her so what i'm gonna do i'm actually gonna take you guys to the event with me so the next scene will be what i actually am wearing i'll probably show you the makeup and then what i'm actually wearing and then i'll take you to the event with me so you can see me suffer <laughs> <laughs> whatever, whatever I wear. This one is comfortable and the Jonathan Simke is, is comfortable. So I'm not really worried about that. But I really feel like she's, I haven't checked my text messages, but I feel like she's going to tell me that I need to slither myself into the one of those, the one that was too short or the other one that was too short. I feel like that's what's going to happen. So stay tuned. Okay, darling, this is two days later. <laughs> I had so much going on on Friday night that I didn't do a check-in. Um, it just took a lot to get out of the house. And so I didn't get a chance to show you guys what I wore then. So I'm showing you what I wore now. And I'm actually going to go take pictures in this look. And so that's why I'm all gussied up. Um, put on a bob wig because I wanted the attention to be on the red lip, the dress, the bag, and the shoe. Riley, how do I look? I look good. Thank you, baby. Um, but yeah, just want to show you the pieces that I got from Rent the Runway. Like I said, this is a $795 dress that I was not prepared to buy full on. So the option of renting, especially cocktail, always works for me. So thank you guys for joining me on this venture with this dress. And um, yeah, if you guys decide to use Rent the Runway, you know what? I'm going to see if there's a an affiliate code or something that I can put in the description box and maybe you guys want to take it out. Um, maybe you guys want to try it out at a discount because I live Rent the Runway. It's the only way to shop for me, especially when it comes to $900, $900,000 cocktail dresses. All right. Have a wonderful day. Love you guys. Bye. Say bye, Riley. Bye. Bye. <laughs>